an indication of how easy to handle a Vulcan is. You can go this slowly to keep position with these two little aircraft. In fact, they're making more noise than she is. That's Ken Rubens flying. Co-captain is Bill Ferrens. Third member of the crew is the Air Electronics Officer, Phil Davies. Now they'll do a little teardrop pattern, which is a sort of uh, horizontal wing over, if you like, to bring them back in front of us. Just here, Vulcan's Olympus engines coming on there. I think we'll hear them rather more loudly, although rather different ones. suspicion of Vulcan's engine slightly opening up and she did so in those days when we all thought that we were going to suffer nuclear annihilation any time. She did so until the Navy took over the uh, nuclear deterrent in the mid-60s. but she can tiptoe up on you. Sixty, so she had her fifty-third birthday last Saturday. She really is a bomber pretending to be a fighter. Now you see that Bombay opening there. The Bombay doors open, and that is where she carries those. beyond the end of this season because she does require major modification next winter. As she comes by this time you can see those bomb doors closing. If you look at them with binoculars you may just be able to see inside. What she really needs is a full commercial sponsor and everybody's been trying for years to get that. She doesn't have one but she does get an awful lot of help from uh, Just as Kev put the power on there, you heard the beginning of the Vulcan howl. Extraordinary noise that is unique to this aircraft. Nobody quite knows why it happens, but it does. And it depends on the weather as well. But you can tell your grandchildren you've heard the Vulcan howl. There's one member, or well, sort of member of the crew that I haven't mentioned, and that's Kevin Stone, Taft Stone. He's the crew chief, the chief engineer, the man who thinks of her 
as my baby, 558 is my baby. He was 25 years in the Air Force and he left to work on the Balkan project. So it's thanks to TAF that we see this aircraft performing so brilliantly in front of us today. I do urge you to go and pay the Balkan village a call or if you don't want to walk over there and it's beside the control tower, beside our, our commentary position, you could contribute to the funds by text, you'd be very welcome, you text to the number 70070, 770, 70070, and you text VULC13, VULC13, 13, plus one more figure for how much you want to give, so it could be 2, 3, 4, or 5. So to contribute three pounds, you text VULC133 to the number 770. Here she is for the last pass with her gear down and wait for the sound as those Bristol Olympus engines spool up.